Quick update on her ankle. Uh, we took this off because it stunk and she needed to wash it and they said that you can uh, take it off. <coughs> and uh, yeah, so turn it. Which way? That way. Here is what it looks like on the side. We now have bruising up the leg. And all of this, leave it straight, this is how big it is. Put your other ankle here, can you, or no? For size comparison, <laughs> uh, even her foot, this foot here is so swollen. I don't know if you can see like how big that foot is compared to that foot i mean it's huge Look like the yeah and then and she now has bruising on this side as well and it goes up the back so this is actually pretty bad looking um this looks worse than the first break she ever had uh yeah so that's an update not a good one all right guys, good morning and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to the orthopedic surgeon. Ta-da! I can't even see her. You can't even, there she is. <laughs> so, we unwrapped it. I cleaned it. I was stanky. It itches now? Probably because I cleaned it. And um, so that's the footage I filmed. So what do you think is going to happen? What do you think? Do you think it's fractured? Do you think it's not? What do you think? Now that you've had it for three days. I don't think it's broken. No? Because I can walk. Like stand on. Yeah, but you also have support. Could you stand on it without the support? You didn't let me stand up. <laughs> well, I didn't want you to break it more if it was broken. So I guess we'll find out when we're there. I'd want a boot. She wants a walking boot, so she doesn't have to have crutches. And let me tell you, this orthopedic place is an, almost an hour away. I, I don't know. But supposedly they're the good ones, and everybody likes to go to them because sugar. it's sugar. <laughs> yeah. Just don't do it in the morning with the strap. Oh, right. So yeah. Anyways, we're gonna park really quick, run in. If I have time to film, we'll talk. If not, we will update you as soon as we're done out of the orthopedic oh and we're getting our driveway uh sealed re-sanded so when you have pavers you have to put sand in them like the sand washes out from the rain and the sand is what like keeps them all tight together so anyways they're re they power washed re-sanding and now they're sealing so we won't have to do that for every two years um it could be three to five years so oh. depends on how much rain we get probably how good of a job he does oh so yeah, he lives in our neighborhood and I think he just started the business because it needed to be. I don't know, but genius. But yeah, so they're doing that. So I'll show you that when we get home. And I'll update you soon. Okay, we made it. My toe's purple. My toe's purple. What toe? Hmm. It's kind of it's not. I told you you wrecked it too. Well, they'll fix it today. Hi guys, so we got home and the orthopedic place. When we got there, um, they asked me a bunch of questions and they, they took another x-ray of my foot, but because like the x-rays were probably like, they were really bad because like, because like my foot was like hurting really bad so like obviously i couldn't like turn it and stuff like that without it hurting a lot 
so they took new x-rays and it turns out it's like this thing called like a avulsion fracture to where like a piece of the bone like comes off but now I have a boot which is better than the cast thing because I don't want crutches and I can actually walk in this so I'd rather have this than crutches but yeah so I think my mom said that we're going to my softball game tonight because I was supposed to have a softball game tonight. Well, obviously I can't play because of my foot, but I would play because one of, we're playing like my, not really my friend, but someone I know's team because I'm not really friends with her, but I know her and I wanted to see how she plays. But yeah, so we're probably going to go there and then... Ga I think Gabby and Peyton have practice. I don't think Peyton does. I don't even know. But one of them have practice tonight. And I'm probably going to watch her do practice too. Because I want to be able to like actually like walk around I guess. I don't know. But. Yeah. So if I was at school. School would have ended like right. Like 10 minutes ago. It's 2.30 right now. We ate lunch at like 1, but I think my game's at 7, so yeah. We'd probably leave early anyways because it'll be like 9.30. I don't know, but yeah. So now I'm going to FaceTime Peyton and Gabby. Hi, guys. So today's Tuesday, and I just got home from interning we left a bit early because all the teachers that were like scheduled for or whatever they didn't have anything for us to do so we'll just make up the hours um another day because like we like i think i need eight this week i think next week's like seven so we don't have to do as much but i just like make it up like it's a very like easygoing thing but um it was good we i helped some kids with their math test today it's pretty interesting they it was like literally multiplying fractions and like decimals and like subtracting i was like i wish my math was like this um so today i'm not going anywhere I don't have plans for a while um i'm going to clean my room i have to study for my anatomy test it's my last test before the quarter ends so i kind of have to do like really 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 well because my grade is a b but it's like a flat like B <laughs> like it's not a B plus so like if I don't do good on this test then I'm like yeah it's gonna be bad so I'm like stressing school's like really hard right now um but oh my gosh I want to show you these things that I'm gonna start working on in art hold on <sighs> they're not the best because I Okay, so we had like three days to work on them, but sometimes I make art like my study hall because it's like super easy, you know? So we were working on these things for like three days and I literally did them in one class period. It's only like a mini sketch, but wait, I drew this eye though, <laughs> but it's very bad. But so we had to do, so, not drew, we had to draw these like self portraits, but like altered and like reflection. It looks nothing like me. I wasn't making it trying to look like me, but like, I have this one. The concept's very weird and it's obviously very bad, but it's just like a rough sketch. And then this one, which is like a mirror. They're very bad, but I wanted to show you because I like the meaning behind them. <laughs> I'm not, I, I'm, I'm not saying I'm good at art at all, but like, so like the, the first one that I showed you, that's like the alteration. So it's like divided in half and then like, you have one eye that's like gonna be in like graphite and then the hair is gonna have um I have to bring in tape and then I'm writing words on it like negative words because it's like the dark side because I have to make this eye in like graphite and then this side will be colorful which is a full face which is positive and it'll be in colors and like I'll paint you know so like that's and that's the one I chose um and then the reflection one that one's just like honestly just like looking in the mirror and like people taking like the rude words that's why there's tape over her mouth 
looks nothing like me, but you know. Yeah, those are my sketches from today. This you had to draw three. This was the first one. Wait, that's not it. This was the first one. So bad. I don't even know what that is. <laughs> but yeah, I just wanted to show those because I like the meaning behind them, and that's like the whole purpose of it. So yes, I'll show you the finished product when I'm done though. So yeah, and then I had a. That's it. Really, I didn't have any tests. <gasps> so. I have to say for my anatomy test and that's about it for school so i'm just really chilling at home i might now because i'm filming a video tomorrow in the morning it's before school because i have to have someone else do it too so i'm filming a video tomorrow morning so i really have nothing going on today ellie doesn't well there's a softball game tonight but i don't know if ellie's going to it because mom was like, you don't get to, you're not making plans because you're going to Ellie's softball game, which I wanted to go anyway, so it was okay. Um, but, uh, I'm trying to think if she's going or not. I don't know, but if she is, then I'll just stay home because I'm not going to go to a game where my sister doesn't play. <laughs> but yeah, I do need to start laundry. I did the dishwasher yesterday. Uh, I think we're going through our closets tomorrow, so that should be nice because I really need room in my closet and... I have a lot of tank tops out and it's like getting cold so yes that's how my day went it was really good but i have like literally the worst headache ever so i'm just gonna chillax right now since i'm not doing much what up guys another day another dollar anyways as you all know we've dealt with ellie today it just sucks i feel really bad for her for softball I know she was wanting to move up next year, try to do travel with her two friends, Peyton and Gabby, but I was really hoping she'd get some good time in this year playing, and I think she needed it since it's her first year. And now this happens, so it's, it's very disheartening. I don't think it's really sunk into her, the logic of it, and I know she knows she can't play, but I don't think she really understands that it affects next year too I don't know I mean you can send her some private classes like I'll still take her to hitting after her foot gets done um, that sort of stuff I really wish I could throw the ball my shoulder just hurts so bad that I can't uh, I do go to a doctor here the 12th and then going to get shots in both shoulders. They aren't tore. I did have MRIs. I forget what they said. It is. I'm sure it's from damage. I've had several car wrecks, stuff like that. I know I got arthritis in both of them already, so yeehaw. I can imagine what it's going to be like in another 15 years. But anyways, hopefully these shots help and I can actually throw a ball, catch a ball. I can do it, but it just hurts so bad. But anyways, bad luck. It can happen to anybody. But for some reason, L is the one that gets it all the time. But anyways, moving on to other subjects. Uh, had a driveways clean today. Clean, well they were cleaned yesterday. They sanded them and sealed them today. And they look so much better. It did just rain a little bit on them, which hopefully it was dried up and tacked up enough. I'm actually parked at the neighbor's house next door. But I think they look really good. When you do it, it sort of gives them a darker look like it has been rained on all the time, but seals them. Who would ever think that you have to seal rock, but you do. I don't know. It gets so hot down here that that's all it does. It just bakes everything. Got to stay off of it for two days. Like I said, the neighbor next door, man, they've been gone for, I think, three months. They live up in, I don't even know where they live, up by New York somewhere. 
they only come down here for the winter I think they're fixing to move here permanently but I'm not complaining because we don't have neighbors on either side over half the year so it's pretty nice but like I said they'll be back tomorrow so I have to find somewhere else to park I just wanted to show you my nice driveway it's clean oh yeah besides Ellie's smiley face she painted on the driveway I don't know she's done that six months a year ago I've tried to get it off it won't come off he tried to get off it won't come off that's par for the course all right I think we're fixing to go get something to eat and I think we're gonna go by Ellie's team softball game because they have a softball game tonight I know that'll suck for her even more to have to stand there and not be able to play she's a big girl she'll figure it out she'll move on all right guys we just left the softball field we had a game tonight the game started at 7 30 so they had practice from 7 to 7 30 so we decided to come at 7 to let the coaches know they weren't happy that's for sure and um i mean they were just they weren't angry but they just weren't happy and then uh ellie got to say goodbye to everyone and we basically said see you next season right mm -hmm. <laughs> and then we told them good luck at their game we are on our way to eat dinner at Chili's I asked Emma if she wanted to come but she has a big exam for anatomy which is uh, her AP class and she's struggling a bit in that class so so she has a big test she's studying she said she needs to pick up her room and she's still not feeling the greatest yeah. still not the greatest she's still not feeling the greatest negative for COVID though just in case anyone wants to know uh, COVID is not what's going around to all the kids at homecoming uh, it's just some sort of like viral cold that just makes them feel like poop makes them tired and exhausted and uh, headaches so kind of like C19 but she's been tested multiple times and doesn't have it anywho we're gonna eat chilies and if I have any leftovers or, or I'll order her something I'll text her and see what she's doing she said I think she said she's gonna eat dino chicken nuggets hi guys oh my god it's 11:44. I look so bad. I'm sorry. Today was just not it for me. I did some studying. I didn't do too well on the practice test. And like the practice test is the test with just like some questions like worded differently or like different questions. So I don't really know how well I'm going to do on this test. I like I just about tissues so we got like the skeletal tissues like the muscle tissues okay, connective yeah it's actually very funny so me and Elizabeth actually take the same class but hers is a college course and obviously hers is 10 times harder but like it's just funny because we take the same class and we're both struggling like anatomy is very hard I took psychology like one and two and then I took AP psychology but that's so different from like anatomy. Like I figured it'd be so much easier but no. There's just so much vocab that you have to remember and especially with this chapter it's like oh my god there's so many. I'm just so happy that freaking anatomy is not a requirement to graduate so yeah. Um. But yeah, I made a breakfast burrito and then my mom brought me home a salad from Chili's because chili salads are very good. I ate that, I was did the practice test, studied for a bit, and then I finished the show, um, The Circle, season three. Crazy ending, didn't expect that. Didn't expect them to win. But I finished that and then, yeah, I didn't get to cleaning my room. I'm gonna clean it tomorrow because I don't have anything going on. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I'm going to head to bed because I'm so tired. So I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye, guys.